guys, welcome back to another video, and today we are going to be doing Minecraft gameplay this time instead of art gameplay, um, not art gameplay, speed paint. Um, I'm doing Minecraft gameplay because I haven't played it in a while and I just wanted to play it. I'm doing it mobile instead of, like, the computer because I have a computer, yes, but, uh, I can't do it because, uh, it doesn't allow it and Linux doesn't have another Minecraft. Um, and yeah, and yesterday I couldn't record or make a YouTube video, well, I wanted to make a vlog, but I couldn't because I didn't have enough footage, and also, I went to Fun Spot yesterday, it was really fun, I like the Mind Blower, um, it's in Old Town, Florida, um, they have really good stuff there, and I also ate some sushi, it was delicious, I wanted more, but my dad was like, oh, that's enough, you're only allowed to have the little good things in life, and I'm like, okay, fine, anyways, we're gonna be reading, am I the asshole at work? So, let's get into it. Okay, so, the Reddit is called, Am I the Asshole at Work? Starting to Feel Guilty. Okay, it says, So, I work a shit salar sh salary, and that didn't include Sundays. When I started, they said, Okay, we switched off working from home. 230, 230 to 430 every other weekend. Cool, sounds good. Then switched it right away until 5. Fine, whatever. Stat holidays are the same deal. I am super annoyed and I am probably overreacting, but I always work the holidays, except for Easter, because my boss is an Orthodox Christian, so they celebrate on a different day. And Boxing Day. Originally, I was supposed to work Boxing Days, but I, it fell on a day that the offices are closed anyways. Recently... I've worked three Sundays in a row because my boss was on vacation. My husband asked me to have this long weekend off, Canada Day, but he wouldn't tell me why, he, but I also had a small feeling why he asked. I ended up, it ended up that the new girl, my mat leave replacement, refused to work it and my boss couldn't, so once again it was on me and I don't have a choice. My husband is pissed. He wanted me to take, he wanted to take me to do something for our anniversary, but I don't know what. I ended up going back to, back to my boss and asked if we could shuffle the weekends around, and she said no. I flat out said, I can't work it. I've done three days in a row, three Sundays in a row. Recently, I get no vacation days. At my completely salaried work that, that don't get vacation until they work 12 months. And I just found out that they give the new girl vacation days early. They also give me grief because I have bi-weekly ob appointments and have to have an ultrasound yesterday because my OB was concerned. She has me strongly recommended I get the ultrasound done before I see her next. As she wants to see if he's growing too fast and why maybe. She mentioned if she he's getting too big, they'll introduce me early. I see her Friday Friday now, but my boss has a wedding. I feel bad that she has to come in until 11 a.m., but what am I supposed to do? I tried to shuffle the appointment dates, but it would have ended up being a full four months now. I... Oh, wait, it would have been a full four weeks without seeing her, and I'm 32 weeks pregnant right now. I am not comfortable with that. I also want to mention she is not missing the wedding. It's in late in the afternoon. I don't want to be rude, and I hate feeling entitled like this, but why should I give up my medical care for myself and my baby? Because of scheduling problems at work. I'm doing my best to make the appointments as early as I possibly can make them, and I probably drove them crazy calling back and asking them for different days. I really, I, I really tried to avoid having the appointment on Friday, but it wasn't possible. Scheduling issues aren't my issue. They act like they're doing my favor, what they're doing me a favor when I'm with, while with freaking hell while my child is sick at home. I do a full workload while I'm at home taking care of my toddler. I wear it from home in my bed when I was, when I had COVID a while, pregnant. The first day I called in, I was so sick. 
The second day, my boss told me I had no choice. I had to go in, but I still felt sick. The third day, I was told I better come in and didn't realize you were this bad. Huh, wow, just make sure you stay in the office. Anyway, it really irks to me because the new girl said, oh, I can't work the long weekend, so suddenly it's, it's on me automatically. I've been there longer. Don't, and don't get vacation days, and I just, no. It took, I took it anyways. The new girl can do it. Okay, um, I don't think you're the asshole. You have a lot of stress on you. You're pregnant. Which, first of all, pregnant women should not be working in general. Um, I would say the man is working, but I don't know if he's working or not. So I'm just gonna be like, yeah. Um, she shouldn't be guilty. And then the person's like, sorry. Were you potentially the asshole in the scenario? The fact that your employer has no contingency isn't that your problem. And she's like, yeah, I tend to feel guilty when I put my foot down, even though I, w I know it's stupid. I don't want to be selfish, but sometimes it's too much, said OP. And Banana Bit G says, your business is being selfish and taking advantage of you. They're making you feel like a jerk because it's easier than doing the right thing. You are not being selfish. Please stand up for yourself and don't let a business or a corporation make the problem and they're lacking a plan and investment with your problem. Okay, so first of all, COVID used to be like a very, very serious illness. This workplace is not taking care of, you know, they're not taking care of the regulations. So I would report that. Making a pregnant woman work, I mean, it depends really on how much we should, how much, like, Depends how pregnant you are, I guess. Like, how many months. If she said, like, 35 months, I don't know. I don't know. It, it, if she said, like, 35 weeks, not 35 months, sorry. 35 weeks, then, yeah, you should be, like, you should be at home working and not in the office. If they're making you go into the office, then, yeah. Second, you should not give up your medicaling stuff, like, the medical or the doctor. For your job. That is just, no. Um, yeah. And then, I've been out walking one month ago. This was posted one month ago, so yeah, we had stuff like days old. Um, the person, so this is said, the new girl does seem to have any, doesn't seem to have any issues, and frankly, that's why she gets away with it. Yeah, um, you should be having the vacation, then you should be doing stuff. Um, yeah, you are not the asshole in this situation. You are very, very, you seem like a nice person. Anyways, I really don't know. Anyone could be a bad person. I'm just saying, like, what I hear so far. So, yeah. Anyways, make sure to like and subscribe if you like the content. And if you love cake, then make sure to like and subscribe to the video. I haven't said this enough. If you like the video, you'll get all these cool things. Anyways, you will see my end card or my best videos here, or just some random videos, I mean, that pops up, like, whatever you watch. If you watch Aphmau, then you mean Aphmau videos. If you watch Jack Suck, Jack Suck, I suck at speaking, then it'll be right there. Anyways, um, yeah, make sure to click on my best videos, check the most viewed video, it's a Demon Slayer thing, yeah, it's a drawing thing. Anyways... Um, yeah, I'm doing Minecraft gameplay, because, um, I, I wanted to play Minecraft, I haven't played it in a while. I'm gonna do more Minecraft gameplay and, like, speed paint. I'm gonna balance out, so next one we're either gonna do speed paint, so, yeah. But anyways, okay, make sure to like and subscribe to the video, I'm tired, because I stayed up until, uh, um, like, at 10, I don't know, I'm very tired. Anyways, make sure to like and subscribe, okay, bye.